She be I don't catch you. She I don't catch you. Every time I pass through area. <laughs> Good evening and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Let's talk, ladies. Let's talk. Let's talk. Okay. As you all can see, you can see this video. What really transpired between this guy and um, the lady on the video? Okay. We know that um, most guys in our community they are used to this behavior a lot. Okay. They are used to this behavior because there are people that sat down to listen to them when they start those they are talking, talking, talking like, oh, I do this one, I do this one, I do one for you, I do one for you. A lot of people will be just listening to them and they will just pick the matter out and start saying it everywhere. I noticed that a man that is not really a dusty, a man that is responsible, a man that know who he is, a man that have reputation, somebody that have something to lose, will not even go out and speak about something both of you did together. They will never do that. A man that really have something to lose, that have shame, that have good life, that have something, legacy, something. They can't just go out and tell people that, oh, I slept with this, I do this, I do that with her, I took her to a hotel, all those stuff. You will never see those type of people doing it. The people that normally engage in this behavior are dusty men. All those men when be say they did the bottom. That is why women, you as a woman, you should be very, very careful when you engage with some certain category of men in our community. There are some people you have to say goodbye to. You don't even need to engage yourself with them. I believe what happened in this video is that after this, maybe this guy met this woman somewhere, maybe they have something, maybe they did not have anything because according to the video she said uh, she's married stuff like that and um, she heard that this guy is spilling rumor around that uh, she had something with him at the hotel so i think the husband was there too like we have caught the guy that is uh, passing rumor around about about my wife that she he did something with her so they were just like arguing, the woman was shouting and everything. And um, women need to be very, very careful. And one thing I noticed in our community is that guys like this, whether they did something with you or they did not do anything with you, most of them normally spread malicious gossip. Why? Because many of them are jobless. You can see the way he dressed. You can see the way he is looking. He is, does not look like that gentleman, that normal guy. Is that you, as a woman that is inspiring to be somebody in life, should pick as a partner or should even go around and do anything with people like this. You should be very, very selective when you mess up with guys like this, when you say hi to guys like this, because most of the time it doesn't. Um, necessarily mean that you have to go to a hotel with people like this. At times saying hi to them, they can be bragging like, oh, that girl, she just did greet me, or it look like she liked me, or if I pass it, she must greet me. At times they will just be bragging at the back of their mind, like telling their fellow dusty that, oh, they have something, you are liking them or they will do something to you. Most of our men are used to that attitude of trying to tarnish women's image. What I believe that even if you are a man, you did something with a woman, that thing should not go out between, it should be between both of you. 
It should never be a thing you should be bragging about, you should be talking about because you people do something privately. If you want to brag, you want to boost your ego, this is not the right way for you to do it. Going around bragging that you did something with this woman, you did something with the other one, you did, yes, yeah, she, ah, I saw many, I see many guys normally do it. They normally engage in behavior like this. That is why you as a woman, you need to protect yourself. You need to protect who you make conversation with, who you greet on the way, who you do some certain things with. Because these guys, just saying hi to you at times, they can go to your back bragging to other men that they have they have visited you, they have done something to you. They are, that is it's something that they are used to. I don't know why other men don't call this man out when they engage in that gossip. Why they so much enjoy gossiping something like this. That when you have something to do with the woman, you have to go around spreading malicious rumor, telling people you have slept with her, you have did this with her, you have do that with her. Nobody really asks you. If you want to boost your ego, you should be looking for work because I see that many of you are, that are engaged in this behavior are so jobless. You have nothing to lose. You have no shame. And you as a woman, you should elevate yourself from some certain people. You should just put yourself in a standard that when you see people like this, men like this that are talkative, I know nowadays there are so many men that does nothing but talk too much. They are nothing but talkative. You just have to stay away from them because that is what many of them are, are specialized in doing for years. They will sit down and cook malicious lies about you. Even if they did something with you, you have no right going around and bragging with it in public. Telling people you've done this. Some of them will even describe you, describe everything and you know? all. Some of them, and then I spoke about a guy the other day that go around recording with ladies and all those stuff. Nobody really wants to know what you did with somebody. If we are from a sin, a sin society where people think we may call out another man for doing something wrong. Because most of you, when you find yourself in a place like this, think about you have sister, think about you have you have daughters, think about all this stuff. Maybe this guy did something to this woman, maybe allegedly he did something with this woman but this woman never wanted you to go around spilling a public a, a private something with you she never authorized you to go around telling everybody what you did and what you did not do with her those things should stay in private between both of you this attitude is not nice. If you are a guy, you are engaging in this attitude, it is very, very wrong. I think you should stop immediately because nobody really cares. There are so many ways many of you can boost your ego, your pathology, those type of behavior. And all. There are so many ways you can do it. Most of them want to boast how many or what they have done to this woman, what they have done to that woman. But you cannot boast of five euro or five naira in your account. You cannot boast of jobs you have done. You cannot boast of your career, a successful one. You cannot boast of having a job. You cannot boast of something important. I see this behavior all the time. You see them boasting, have did this, have do that, have friend, have to wear, have do this. Stop. Stop. This is not nice. Going around talking about what you did in private, in darkness with somebody. It is not nice at all. And you ladies stay away from dusty men like this because they have nothing to lose. Probably they have they are the reason they are going to video this and put it on the blog, they met on the blog or married people blog or group, something like that. That the guy posted the lady picture there and all. I noticed something too that the lady did that caught my attention. Let me see. 
if I can find it. The way when the guys. So, uh, Facebook. No, 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 Look at the man, look at that dust something she started to like the massacre the guy she started massacre the guy that was something i really observed her oh was she trying to hide or something eh? i noticed where she for massacre the guy massacre the guy massacre the guy to the essence the guy lose control to even ask of the fun <laughs> again so what are these two people trying to fight around and hide or something? Even if nothing happens, if this guy have no right to go and put the woman outside telling people that something like that happened. Most of these dusty ladies, be careful. They have mouth gossip. This is why they cannot make money if you don't know. This is why they are not rich like their fellow men with bonla. Because they talk too much. If they kiss you, they will go and tell everybody that they have go to your your this thing, your your <laughs> they will go and tell people that they have visited your Jerusalem. So that is why you have to close your Jerusalem from Dusty. Because Dusty have nothing to lose. You see his face. You see his face on Facebook everywhere. Eh? He just picked this poor woman and carry her everywhere. Hmm? And when they will start spreading this light, this lady will have to defend herself. Close your Jerusalem from all these dusty men. They have nothing to lose. That is the problem. They have nothing to lose. Even our women, we be sharp, sharp to go and marry him with the mentality he had that if he wire a woman, he will go and spread it everywhere. They will still see who will marry him. But you, you will see if you have a relationship, they will pour some sand into your relationship. And we just miss your relationship with sand and problem. If reputation is still remaining, they will just throw it on the floor and break it. That is why you should be careful. Don't miss with those things. There are so many men that are not dateable, no marriageable in our society. The time ladies start to understand, you will know. This type of men that talk around, gossip around what they did and what they stopped doing, they are very, very problematic when you go around and meet with them. Be careful, ladies. Be, be, be very careful. Maybe something happened, maybe nothing happened. But the way this woman was shutting him up when he wanted to pick the phone, with 
Boza, 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 boza. The thing look very, very suspicious, and um, it looks somehow, how maybe because of the pain, because these people they throw pain at you. That is why you have to be wise. Don't mess up with them. Don't mess up with dusty. Dusty is going to be a dusty. They don't change. It is not dusty because they don't have money like or like any other person. They are dusty because of their mentality, the way they think, the way they do things is a very, very problematic. So ladies, take this video and use it to advise yourself. Close your Jerusalem and um, enjoy your woman out so that you will not end up using slippers to massacre a ghetto like this. So I love you all. This is the real girl. Love yourself. Raise your standard and be positive. I love you. Bye.